What day is it? Game day. Good morning, guys. It's a wonderful Saturday, and Christopher was a really good baby today and let us sleep in until 8 a.m. OMG. It felt like I slept for an entire day. Like, I feel so good and refreshed. Uh, my son is the best. So, to celebrate, I'm gonna eat some fatty foods. But first, I'm gonna do the dishes. <laughs> Christopher, what do you got? He won't even look at me. He's just obsessed with food. It's in your blood. What do you got? You got some toast? A delicacy among babies. It was really cool when he learned to feed himself, but it'll be even cooler when he learns to feed himself till he throws up. Boop, 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 boop. There it is. Quite the fluffy pillow. I swear I was here first. She just does this. We each have our own kitty, Christopher. You're abusing yours. sleeping. It's very similar to working for the bomb squad. You have to move softly and calmly and very calculated. I just feel like if you wake up a baby, it's probably just as bad as an explosion too. It's an explosion of tears. It's looking good out here today. It's a good day for football. Got some cool plans today. Going over to our friend's house. Housewarming party. Probably bring you along. It might be weird for the people at the party tonight to see me holding a camera because they probably expect me to be holding a sandwich. Look at this. This makes me look larger. Larger than life. What are you doing? Jonathan, can you go clean up the blood in comics? Blood in comics? Yeah, go look. Blood in comics? What is she talking about? Oh. There's the blood. There's the comics. Yeah, I was kind of up last night. I don't know about the blood, man. I might have been up a little too late last night. Huh? Something crazy might have happened. I know some comic fanboy is going to be like, Ugh, Judd, those are graphic novels. Ugh. Go away, dude. No one likes you. We're not savages. We use spoons. You don't. You are a savage. Hey, buddy. You got mommy's phone? Did, did you know you got mommy sick, too? Yeah, whatever, dude. He doesn't care. Tired? You gonna take a nappy? Christopher, how much toilet paper do you need? You don't even wipe yet. So I'm headed over to my friend's house, Booker, John Booker. Um, he was in my first vlog ever. He came over and watched the Buckeyes game with us. You might remember he said my vlog sucks, and uh, that's just the kind of sense of humor he has. He's really funny. He's not a negative person. Uh, he's actually probably someone I would consider one of the funniest people I know. Looks like a storm's coming. Every time I think a storm's coming, I think of that dumb line in episode one, The Phantom Menace, where the woman's like, There's a storm coming, Annie! And that's her line. And now she's part of the Star Wars mythos. Or mythos. I don't know. It's one of those two. I would love to get one line in just a really famous movie. Just one line. In fact, I would really love to have just a gruesome death scene in a movie. And that's all I get. Hey, get off my car! And then... Just brains and guts everywhere. That'd be awesome. When I'm not working... I just get hungry. I just am hungry. Like, when I exist, I'm hungry. If I got my mind concentrated on something else, I can ignore the hunger. But it's just this constant sort of, feed me. I'm like the, uh, I'm like the killer plant in Little Shop of Horrors, if you've ever seen that. You should, it's really good. Another little thing about me is I really like Broadway musicals. I just name-dropped Little Shop of Horrors. 
Uh, but right now my favorite is probably Book of Mormon. I know, a slave to trends. Uh, but I'm a big fan of Pippin as well. Whatever, dude. Booker, what do you think about Whatever, dude? I've always believed in it. Uh, it's been more a lifestyle than a saying, and uh, it's really got me where I am today. And where are you? Um, yeah. You look like you're modeling. Yeah. Uh, I've been asked. Would you say your body is a wonderland? I'd say your vlog sucks. It's always great hearing the encouraging words of John Booker there. Headed home now to finish the game and uh, hang out with my son. Lauren is really getting too sick to uh, be a mother, but I guess I guess you don't get any sick days when you're a parent. I, I didn't see that in my contract. Christopher, the game is on. Do you want to watch the game? Oh, you just want to destroy this playmat. So I'm back at home, hanging out with the kid, watching the game. Poor Lauren, already asleep. Being sick already sucks, but being sick and a parent, that's got to be tough. Haven't been there yet. Still time. You're a real knee slapper, right? And now you're eating my knee. No, you can't be sad. Mommy's sick. You have to you have to power through, okay? No, 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 no. Christopher, you just can't go through life screaming. Oh no. Oh no, eat this. I know lemon's not your favorite. Lauren requested the best place to eat when you're sick, Kentucky Fried Chicken. It's always been one of my favorite places to go and it's, it's really heartwarming when my wife asks for it as well. We were meant for each other. I feel like our love was fate and you can't spell fate without fat. I don't work for KFC, like they didn't pay me to say all this stuff, like I just genuinely love fried chicken in general. My favorite place is not even available in my state, it's uh, Bojangles. If you live near Bojangles, it, you are truly blessed. Look at the entrance to this KFC. It's got a freaking torch going. It's a weird entrance for a KFC. Do I have to like answer the Sphinx's riddle to get my order? Don't tell Lauren, but I got something for myself. Yeah, yeah, you good. Well, that sandwich is gone. That means the evidence is gone. The perfect crime she'll never know! <laughs> Alright, well I dropped off the food to Lauren, kissed her goodbye, not like forever, and headed off to the housewarming party. Got my penguin wine. I'm excited. My buddy Dustin, who was on the vlog the other day, yeah, he's got a house, he's bought a new house, and uh, we're gonna check it out. Very excited to see his man cave. He's super into uh, Transformers, so maybe we'll see something in disguise. Ah! I'm just kidding, I'm, I'm, my eyes are on the road, sorta. All right, we've arrived at Dustin's and he's the grill master. <laughs> There's no gatekeeper, right? There's no gatekeeper. Okay. What are, you, uh, what are you cooking for us today? We're cooking some hamburgers and hot dogs. Ah. Hot dogs just went in though, so no, just no. Why am I out here then if there's food ready? I don't know, what are you that's doing? Nice. That's nice, that's a grill my friends. It is, infrared technology. Infrared, like the predator. Yes. <laughs> Thank God I don't have three dots, wait, do I have three dots on me? Goodbye. Uh, oh shit. <laughs> How old are you? 30. <laughs> Look at all so those transformers. Probably between 27. Do any of them transform into a social life? No. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That's pretty cool. It's awesome, dude. That is... I mean, I like comic books, but I... I don't even compare to this. I should give up. Yeah. The only time it even... water you could see into this place was during that big rainstorm. And it was over there. But then that... The second one that happened like... That is crazy. Only hit this end. And then you think you're done. And then it's like, bam, Halo. And then that stuff, and more stuff. Transformers. This is certainly a man cave. Pretty wild. Oof. 
So I just got out of Dustin's. It was a great time. Uh, what a generous dude to uh, have all those people over and, and feed me. Feeding me is like feeding a small country. It was a relaxing day. It was chill. I got to spend some time at home. I got to go out. Uh, it was a classic Saturday fatter day. I got free food, ate a lot, and started to feel ashamed. But when that shame creeped in, whatever, dude. All right, guys, I'm going to call it a night. It's been long. I've been up late. Just ready to edit and go to bed. Hope you guys have a great weekend, and we'll see you tomorrow. Whatever, dude.